I have been into woodworking my entire life and built just about everything there is to build. And getting close to retirement, I kind of wanted to do something different. I couldn't see myself building birdhouses for the rest of my life as a hobby. So I got into metalwork and thinking about what do I want to do with my spare time for a hobby, I can't imagine a better marriage than the wood and steel together in a gun. Plain and simple. Building a gun is actually very straightforward. You got a piece of wood, you got a barrel, and you got your lock. Basically, lock, stock, and barrel. And what you want to do is marry the three together. The, uh, the steel has to fit into the wood just so, and the lock mechanism has to be married to the barrel and the stock, along with the trigger. And Basically, it's a lot of wood carving, a little bit of metal filing, and just a lot of playing around to get everything perfect. In the end, the barrel should look like it actually grew in the wood. Every rifle barrel is different. I might find that, uh, say for a 50 caliber, a 495 ball would be good easy to buy, but the gun might get a little bit more accurate with the 497 ball. So there's no way I'm going to be able to buy that anywhere. I've got to make my own. I've never thought of guns as self-defense uh, instrument. I wasn't raised in a family with guns or anything like that. I strictly look at it from a sporting point of view. There's nothing better than a freezer full of deer meat, so I need a gun to do that. And I love to hunt. Nothing better than being in the, in the outdoors and basically seeing heaven out there and talking to God while you're waiting for a deer to come by. Mm -hmm. 